Welcome to Baugan Inglés 4.0, the radio show with Kyle Miller. Following class by class, step by step, the material of Baugan Inglés 4.0 on Aprende Inglés TV. Clase 25. Class 25. Let's go! Beginner. Okay, bienvenidos. Bienvenidos a clase 25. Welcome to class 25. We're going to get started with a review of what we were looking at in the last class. That's right, a little review with what we were talking about in class 24. We were talking about the, well, we were talking about nationalities. Estuvimos hablando de nacionalidades. And People are, people are, people are, que es muy, muy importante. The people in Canada are Canadian. The people in Spain are Spanish. Are the people in Colombia Brazilian or Colombian? The people in Colombia are Colombian. So as repeat with me. The people in Colombia are Colombian. SOS. Yes, that's right. Are the people in Venezuela? Venezuela. Are the people in Venezuela Venezuelan or Peruvian? Are the people in Venezuela Venezuelan or Peruvian? Conmigo, siempre en voz alta. The people in Venezuela are Venezuelan. SOS. Are the people in Bolivia Bolivian or Argentinian? Are the people in Bolivia Bolivian or Argentinian? The people in Bolivia are Bolivian. Are the people in India Indian or French? <laughs> are the people in India Indian or French? The people in India are Indian. They're not French. They're Indian. The people in India are Indian. Es muy, muy, muy importante que digáis, the people are, people are, people are, people are, siempre, siempre, siempre. Porque en español, en castellano, digáis, la gente es, pero en inglés digamos, la gente son. The people are, okay? Are the people in Ethiopia, um, are they Egyptian or Ethiopian? The people in Ethiopia are Ethiopian. Are the people in Russia Chinese or Russian? The people in Russia are Chinese. The people in Russia The people in Russia are Russian, disculpa. The people in Russia aren't Chinese, they're Russian. The people in China are Chinese and the people in Russia are Russian. The people in Spain are Spanish. Fíjate que no digo Spanish, sino Spanish. The people in Spain are Spanish. The, pe the people in Spain are Spanish. Eso es. Ok, luego hemos visto, are we, are we on earth? Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Are we on the bus? No, we aren't. También se puede decir, no, we're not. No, we're not. No, we aren't. No, we're not. Are we friendly? Yes, we are. Are we in Spain? Yes, we are. Are we in Spain? Yes, we are. We're in Spain. Are we people? Yes, we are. Are we elephants? No, we aren't. In both alta. No, we aren't. Are we speaking English? Yes, we are. Are we speaking Russian? No, we aren't. And the other contraction? No, we're not. SOS. No, we're not. No, we aren't. No, we're not. Are we Chinese? No, we aren't. Oh, no, we're not. Are we German? No, we aren't. No, we're not. Are we sitting? Yes, we are. Are we standing? No, we're not. Are we making an effort? Haciendo un, es un esfuerzo. Are we making an effort? Yes, we are. Are we reading the newspaper? No, we're not. 
Are we having an English class? Yes, we are. Are we speaking in English? Yes, we are. Very good. Yes, we are. No, we aren't. Yes, we are. No, we aren't. No, we're not. We're not. Very good. Word of the day. Oh yes, it's time now for the word of the day. The word of the day today is is, is un verbo. The verb to need, necesitar, to need. Y otra vez estoy fijando con la pronunciación aquí need de, de, con la de acabando con la de need. No digo need ni need, pero, pero need de de need. I need, you need, he needs. Necesito. I need. Necesito. Necesito agua. I need water. Necesitas agua. You need water. You need water. To need. I need. He needs. Needs. Okay, very good. Needs. Ahora vamos a practicar con el present continuous. El presente continuo. Present continuous. Are you sitting or standing? I am sitting. I am. I am the verb to be. I am. I am sitting. Más gerundio. Verbo en gerundio. I am sitting. I am sitting. Con la contracción, I am sitting. I am not standing. I am sitting. He is sitting. He is sitting. Con la contracción, he's sitting. I'm sitting. He's sitting. She's sitting. We're sitting. You're sitting. Es muy fácil porque ya sabemos conjugar el verbo to be. Y es nada más que colocar el gerundio del verbo después, ¿vale? He's sitting. Tenemos el verbo to be. He is. I am. I am Canadian. I am sitting. I am speaking. You are Spanish. You are sitting. You are listening. My brother is Canadian. He is. Okay. He is. He is Canadian. He is. He is. He is. He is sitting. He is listening. He is paying attention. Okay. Are you eating? Contestame. Answer me. Are you eating? No, I'm not eating. Are you working? No, I'm not working. Are you listening? Yes, I'm listening. Are you driving? No, I'm not driving. Are you cooking dinner? No, I'm not cooking dinner. I'm not cooking dinner. ¿Estás, estás cocinando la cena? Are you cooking dinner? No, I'm not cooking dinner. Is your father playing tennis? No. He's not playing tennis. He is not. He's not. No, he's not playing tennis. Is your mother swimming? Is she? Is she swimming? No, she's not swimming. Is she playing tennis? No, she's not playing tennis. Is she driving the car? No, no, she's not driving the car. No está condu conduciendo el coche. She's not driving the car. No. Is she playing tennis? No, I told you. Ya, ya, ya te he dicho. No, she's not playing tennis. Is she listening to the English class? Yes, she's listening to the English class. Is Alberto teaching English? Yes, Alberto is teaching English at the moment. Yes. Am I speaking? Yes. Am I speak? Yes. Yes, Kyle, you're speaking. And me? Yes, I'm speaking. Am I speaking French? No, you're not. You're not speaking French. Am I speaking German? No, you're not. You're not speaking German. Am I speaking English? Yes, you're speaking English. Yes. Are you playing cards? Are you playing cards? No, I'm not playing cards. Are you... Paying attention, prestando atención. In English, pagamos atención, no prestamos. Pagamos, we pay attention. Are you paying attention? Are you paying attention? I hope so. Are you paying attention? Yes, I'm paying attention. Yes, teacher, yes, I'm paying attention. Is your brother singing the song? No, 
No, he isn't. He isn't singing the song. No está cantando. He isn't singing the song. He's not singing the song. Are they driving? No, they're not driving. They are not driving. Are they driving? No, they're not driving. Is he reading? Está leyendo. Is he reading? Yes. See, sí. yes, he's reading. Are they coming? See, sí. yes, they're coming. They are there. They're coming. Yes, they're coming. Yes, see, sí. estamos. That is, ladies and gentlemen, the present continuous. Very easy, isn't it? Muy fácil, no? Present continuous. So we have the verb to be conjugated according to our subject, and then the gerund. No problem. Vocabulary of the day. Oh, yes, it's time now for the vocabulary of the day. Our vocabulary. Vamos a ver nuestros cinco palabras de vocabulario hoy. Debajo de. Debajo de. Mis pies están debajo de la mesa. Under. Under. No digo under, but un, under. Under. My feet are under the table. My feet are under the table. Muy. Muy. Very. Very. Muy, muy. Very. Camarero. Camarero. ¿Cómo se dice eso? En inglés, waiter. 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 Wait, como esperar. Pero waiter. Waiter. W-A-I-T-E-R. Como waiter. Waiter. ¿Y, y, y camarera? Waitress. Waiter, que es masculino. Waiter. And waitress. Justo como actor. Actor. Y actress. Ok. Tom Cruise is an actor. Penelope Cruz is an actress. He is a waiter. Él es camarero. She is a waitress. Ella es camarera. Pared. Pared. O oh, muro. Wall. Wall. Pared. Wall. Agua. Water. Water. Yes, water. Ok, hemos visto. Debajo de. ¿Cómo se dice? En voz alta. Debajo de. Under. Eso es. Muy. Very. Very. Oh, this is a very good class, Kyle. This is a very good class, Mr. Teacher. Thank you. This is a very good class. Very. Very. Fíjate que no estoy diciendo very, sino very. Es como un F... Vocalizado, ¿vale? F con F. F very, very good V. Victory in Valencia. <ríe> con la V, ¿vale? Very, very. Camarero. Waiter. Eso es. Pared o muro. Wall. Wall. Y agua. Water. Water. Very good. Ok, ahora vamos a practicar in front of, delante de, detrás de, behind, behind, y next to, al lado de, al lado de. Ok. So, for example, el papel está delante de mí. The paper is in front of me. In front of me. Mi hermano está detrás de mí. My brother is behind me. My brother is behind me. Ella está al lado de mí. She is next to me. She is next to me. Okay? In front of, delante de, behind, detrás de, next to, al lado de, next, next to, pero digamos next, next to, next to, 
next to. Ahora con nuestro vocabulario, otra vez con el camarero. El camarero está al lado de la puerta. The waiter is next to the door. Yes, el camarero está al lado de la puerta. The waiter is next to the door. ¿Y qué más? Aquí tenemos... Ah, pared. Wall. Wall. El camarero está, um, está detrás de la pared. The waiter is behind the wall. The waiter is behind the wall. El bolígrafo, el bolígrafo está delante de, bueno, delante del lápiz. The pen is in front of the pencil. Y ahora el bolígrafo está detrás del lápiz. The pen is behind the pencil. Y ahora el bolígrafo está al lado del lápiz. The pencil, o bueno, the pen is next to the pencil. Está al lado de. The pen is next to the pencil. It's next to the pencil. Está al lado. It's behind. Está detrás de. It's behind the pencil. And it's in front of. Está delante de. Delante del lápiz. It's behind the pencil. El coche está delante del edificio. The car is in front of the office. Well, the, el edificio, disculpa. Oficina, no, edificio, the building, the building. The car is in front of the building. El coche está delante del edificio. El coche está detrás del edificio. The car is behind the building. Y ahora está al lado, está justo al lado. El coche está al lado del edificio. The car is next to the building. It's next to the building. Ok. Otra vez con el camarero. El camarero está al lado de la puerta. The waiter is next to the door. The waiter. And the female version, do you remember? The female is waitress. The waitress... La camarera está al lado del camarero. The waitress is next to the waiter. The waitress is next to the waiter. Eso es. Very good. Muy bien. Do you remember the word of the day? Do you remember the word of the day? To need. Necesitar. To need. To need. Need. No es need, sino need. Today I need, yesterday I needed. I need a drink. Necesito agua. Bueno, I need water. Necesito agua. Okay. I do. I need water. I need a break. I need to finish. Porque nos hemos quedado sin tiempo. Vale. Hasta la próxima. Hasta pronto. Ciao. Bye-bye. <laughs>